Right on. Welcome to Creepy Waves FM, Bugs Fixer. I guess we're going to be fixing bugs in some kind of tech company? I, I don't know. Looks interesting, at least. What a, what a weird little basement apartment we have here. Uh, yeah, go. Let's just, uh, new game. Way ahead of you. I'm wearing them right now. Creepy Waves FM. Bucks Fixer. Strange Noises at Work by Horrorwave FM. Posted by Random Guy with Mouse. Two years ago. Huh, well, okay. I used to work at a small game dev startup with two friends and our manager. After we launched a few popular titles, big companies started offering us jobs. Eager to work on larger games, I was the first to accept an offer. It was a tough decision, as my team felt like family. When I came to the interview, I felt guilty, as if something bad was about to happen. Anything else, or are we done? Oh, here we go. Okay. Hey, you asleep? Nervous about the interview? Nah, just a bad night. Bad dreams again? You're taking your pills, probably. I've just had too much on my mind. Got it. Who is this? My dad, or...? Hey, we've got coffee. Uh, can you make us some? It'll wake us up before the interview. Uh, sure. Or maybe a colleague. Alright, let's, uh... Ooh, hold on. Gotta increase that mouse sensitivity a little. That's a little better. Alright. TV shows these days are so funny. You guys call it cringe, right? Oh god. Okay. Server room. Kitchen. I mean, the kitchen is where I would assume I can make coffee. Toilets. Oh, can I go? I can. What? I'm sorry, are these porno mags next to the... I was in such a hurry to use the bathroom that I almost forgot to close the door behind me. <laughs> well, okay. Uh, I'm just gonna look around for a bit. Power station. I'm guessing this is the game company. And this is where I make some coffee. Ooh. Look at all these people working. Alright. Can I go in the other rooms? I probably shouldn't. Like, this is a server room, so that's definitely locked. Oh. That's an unpleasant thing to have in the kitchen, Jesus Christ. Why would you do that? Alright. Anyway, let's uh... I just want to see if I can use the bathroom. Whoop. Sure enough! Hey, rather that than peeing in the middle of an interview. Uh... <laughs> oh, you actually uh... fuck around on your phone while you're on the, <laughs> on the can? That's good. Clock and calculator are updating. As well as the notes and the cat clicker. Tasker app. Uh-huh. No tasks. Contacts. David. Hmm. No messages from the looks of it. Okay. Let's get back up. That's interesting. So that's how you, uh... That's how you check your progress. By taking a dump. Ah, uh, Yes. The boss makes a dollar, I make a dime. That's why I poop on company time. Alright, anyway, coffee. Ba boom. Ba boom. How do we turn it on? Ah, there we go. Alright. <laughs> to throw. I gotta throw coffee at people. Feeling better? We'll call you in for the interview soon. Oh! Hello, sir. Um... Glad you both made it. We're excited you're interested in our game developer role. Thank you. Our CEO really wanted to meet you. Uh, he's here too. I'll show you around. I'm ready. After that, I'll take just the candidate with me if that's okay. No worries. Just wanted to make sure you didn't skip out. Young folks, you know. Great. 
Please follow me. Okay, so that is the dad. Good luck, champ. Gee, thanks for the vote of confidence, you dick. Just making sure he won't skip out. Is this the CEO? Hello. Great to meet you. I've heard impressive things about you. Candidate had a big year. Two award nominations, hundreds of thousands of downloads, stellar reviews. This office is where games are perfected pre-release. You'll start with small prototypes to show how quickly you improve. Oh, so show how quickly you improve them. Eventually, you might lead major projects. I'll give it my all, sir. With your track record and our marketing, you're a great fit. Your recommendation says you were the best of your team. Oh, it was a team effort, sir. Don't be shy. Here, we need you to stand out and wow our customers. And ready to start? Yes, sir. There's a PC ready with a game for you to fix. You've got 60 minutes to find and fix as many bugs as possible. Let us know when you're done. Good luck. This one? Oh, I guess that's this. Okay. Okay. Uh. Okay. I should open the bugged file to start fixing. I need to start typing to edit the file. I have no idea what I'm doing here, by the way. I'm just... Okay. Uh, okay, so I guess the other one. Just type it, type it, type away. Look at me fixing things. Okay. Uh, so now. Need and speed. Zero concept prototype. Well, I mean, it's. Whoop, it seems to work now. Whoops, see, there you see. Stop. Oh, I guess we got another gold collecting. Okay. So this seems like a simple phone game. Alright. Oh, what was that? Visual effects. I guess there's a visual effect that isn't working. Alrighty then. Yeah, this is how coding works, right? Just type for a while and then that fixes everything. Seems like... whoops. Okay, hold on. Can I talk to people? I cannot. Okay, back to the PC then. Yes. Go on. Okay. Oh, what's this? Road barriers. Alright then. Oh! Magnificent! You made it in a few minutes! But you only completed half the task. Sorry? Besides gameplay, What's a crucial part of player experience? What makes games more exciting? A deep narrative, polished graphics and smooth mechanics or interactive gameplay elements? Well, that's that's the gameplay. A deep narrative? <laughs> Wrong. Mm, mo more content? Monetization features. Loot boxes, exclusive skins, unlockable content. This really engages players. Make them carve their own unique gameplay. Now let's see you add some of these features. Be creative. Improvise. Oh, I don't like that at all. Alright, I guess we're working for... a real fucking scumbag company. Yep, here come the ads. 
Ah, oh, jeez. All right. Wow, really? How many fucking ads are we gonna have on the screen at once? Oh, man. Well, this immediately sucks all of my ass. Oh. What the? Yeah, the game changed. I don't like that this guy can, like, look at me the whole time. This is why I couldn't work in an office. <laughs> What's happening? This game completely changed. Oh! Oh, hello! Hi! <laughs> Behind me! What's up? What was that? What are you guys doing? Good. This looks just perfect. Um. Perfect. The pop-ups encourage exploring secondary features. We're sending this prototype to production. There was something on the monitor. I only see excellent work here. Actually, you likely have just built a coffee on a laptop. Uh, just so you know, candidate's manager mentioned that he has, chronic, has a chronic condition. It was controlled by medication since childhood, uh, but it can cause mild hallucinations under stress. That's great! When I was young, I wanted to play baseball, but my knees were too weak. Life balances us out. Now, I lead a company making games that everyone awaits. We'll discuss everything with your manager. Now please, meet your new team lead and exchange contacts. Because your trial shifts would be at night, Quite the romantic time here, if I might say. We're confident you'll manage. Good luck, lad. Thank you. Well, this might be a slightly weird situation I'm in. Hello. Fixed, fixed, fixed. Hey, are you the new guy? Yes. Nice to meet you. Hope you like it here. The first few days are always hardest. What, uh, what projects are we working on? I've been here three years, handling some AA projects. You'll catch on quick. Thanks. Email me anytime. Great meeting you. Say, have you seen anything weird happen here? Weird? Uh, just the donuts disappearing before lunch on Tuesdays. Why? I'm just getting to know the place. Got it. Don't forget to try donuts. It's Tuesday. Work hard until you die and then start over. <laughs> okay. Love the sound of that. Bunch of tablets here. Alright. Let me just see if I can talk to everybody. I can. Hello there. Need any help? Uh, just getting used to the office. We just met, but I sent some bad vibes around you. Bad vibes? Yeah, like someone put a hex on you. How can you tell? Just a gut feeling. You know, like you're exactly where you need to be, but with a twist. If the vibe is strong, it usually means trouble. Uh, I'm I'm sorry. I don't know much about this stuff. <laughs> I'm just messing with you, newbie jokes. If not me, then one of those hardcore guys would have. They're the real pranksters. <laughs> I almost believed you. Yeah. Are you waiting for my PC? Sorry. From IT, right? I've been waiting for help all week. Uh, oh no, I'm actually new here. Oh, my bad. I thought you were the IT guy. Nice to meet you. Did something happen? Oh, just some annoying app update errors I've been dealing with all week. We're supposed to use only the latest version, so it's been frustrating. Ended up updating them myself using the exec files. Wait, you hacked your own work PC? No bad intentions. I have deadlines to meet. I see. Alright, let's uh move out from here. Hello. Nice to meet you. New around here? Yeah. I remember my first day. You must be very agitated. What are you working on? Uh, same thing that you'll be doing whole day. Bugs fixing. It's simple. Guys from production just create a mess, and we need to make it work. You know what I was doing last year? Cat clicker. You know what was wrong? What? A dog. Cat clicker with a dog logo. And it was my responsibility to mention it. 
Sounds funny. Yeah, it does, but fun really stops with responsibility. Remember, you will be responsible for every mistake you forget to fix. And a dog logo in a cat game may become your stupid mistake, not someone who's initially put it there. I remember that. Yeah, that- see, that I've tried. I have tried being responsible for someone else not doing their job well. And that shit sucks. Alright, I guess you're the team lead? Hello. Yeesh. Nice to meet you. I'm your new team lead. How are you settling in? Oh, great. Not everyone's in the office today. Uh, more than half work from home. You will also be able to after completing the trial period. Yeah, I like it here. It's a good place. Lots of security. Uh, but remember, you can never have too much security. That's why I keep my baby close. You mean a gun? Technically, yes. It's more like a self-defense device. Wait, there's a gun in the office? Don't worry. It's locked away in my desk. Hmm. Where did I put that key? Anyway, you start the night shift tomorrow. There's a simple prototype. Fix it, then head home. Do well, and you'll be full-time in a week. I'll do my best, sir. <laughs> That's what I like to hear. Your floor access is restricted, and stay out of the server room. That's it. Good luck. Thank you. That's something I... No, I thought it was uh, flashing because I couldn't interact with it, but nope. All right. What a job I've got. Oh. They disappeared. Hey, Dad. So, how was it? Not too scary, right? I think I'm going mad. Let's talk on the way to the car. You finished up quickly. Yeah. So yeah, let's uh, let's get out of here, I guess. You coming, Dad? Dad, what the hell? You coming? Come on, fucking... You get in here. God damn it. What happened? I saw something scary on the screen. Something? Something very scary. You told me you take your medication, right? Always! It might be stress rela- No! Oh! Whoa. Oh. Well, music is back. That was real, huh? Sorry. Come on, let's just keep going. I'm here to support you because I believe in your skills. Not because I doubt you. I want you to succeed. Try to relax. Remember, good sleep is key. Call me- Oh, that was his manager! Okay. Today was tough, huh? And what did the CEO and HR say? They were impressed, especially the CEO. You couldn't believe how talented you are. And how our startup hired such a talent. You sound jealous. <laughs> Maybe a little. We've all been working together for so long, after all. Don't forget to text the others. They've been asking about you. I will. Oh, you can pull out your phone whenever. Okay, that's interesting. Uh, so can I text David? Nope. I can't, I can't just send whatever I want, apparently. That's unfortunate. Um, okay. Well, on I go. Oh, there's someone sitting over there. There's a lot of people here. Let's see. Can I talk to everybody? Analytical thinking, strategic planning, being innovative, always learning, and... What was the last one? Oh yeah, results oriented. Let's start with some easy questions to get to know each other. Is that the CEO? Or is that just a guard? That's a guard. Sun's shining, birds are chirping, and I'm in for a long night shift. <laughs> okay, sir. We'll have a good one, then. Hello. Am I s- ah! 
My son loves coming to the office. He likes to learn about work early on. Ew. His whole head spinning while his body doesn't move at all. That was... Don't do the same thing, kid. This building is huge. They even have selfie zone on the roof. What? A selfie zone. Well, whatever you say, kid. Hello. Okay, not in the talking mood, I see. That's totally fine. I shall respect your, your space. Let's get the hell out of here. Ooh. Make laundry. Alright. I should maybe also clean up at some point. Alright, get the laundry. This I know how to open phone, damn it. Make laundry. Put dirty clothes into the washing machine. Hold on. Do I have a message? I do not. Okay. I should have placed into the washing machines first. My hands were full. Alright. Where do you hide your washing machine then? I'm gonna assume... Yep. Sure enough. Well, you really just throw your clothes around anywhere, huh? Hey. You can't claim I don't do the same thing. Oh, I can only take one at a time, apparently. Alright. Pop that fucker in. Let's explore the apartment a bit. Uh-huh. Nice little TV. Some basic bitch paintings. Lots of pictures of cats, apparently. Uh, some snacks. Nice little workstation. Okay. I mean, this looks like a nice enough place. Some pizza. Alright. Pop this in. Grab the shirt from the floor. There was a shirt around here somewhere. There it is. Is that the house manager? Alright. Uh, tasker app. There's one more piece of laundry somewhere in the house. I just have to look around for it. Okay, so, where is this last elusive piece of laundry? Where could that be? It's not my shoes. Newspaper. Oh, no. Deal with that later. Huh. Where's my last bit of laundry? Oh! Alrighty then. So far, this is riveting. Now I can start the washing program. Yeah. Do, 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 do. Broken. Building manager probably knows how to fix this. Or oh, there was a street laundry nearby. So, in other words, uh, call the building manager or visitors. Call the building manager. I don't want to go to a street laundry if I can help it. I should have the house manager contact my phone. Uh-huh. Hi, sorry to bother you. My washing machine's acting up. Can you take a look? Room 416, be there in a minute. Hope you have some beer in the fridge. Oh, um, okay. So, where's the baby? In the bathroom. Right in here, sir. Well, this is incredibly mundane so far. Sorry to tell you, mate, but I'll need to order some spare parts. Wait, something is seriously broken? Yeah, microcontroller. Can't simply fix it. Shipment will take a few weeks. I'll order it and fix it later. There's a public laundry just around the corner. Some folks prefer using it over buying on washer. I'll give it a try. It's open 24-7. Just try to avoid going late at night. Why so? 
It's usually safe, but different people wander off the dock. Well, thanks for the advice. I should go to the laundry then. Should be near the house. Alright, guess you didn't care about beer after all. Hey, fine by me. That's my beer. Can I throw a thing in the garbage? Because this place is, uh... I can! Nice. Okay. I have a feeling that's, uh... I have a feeling the game will ask me to do that later. Actually, fuck it. I'm doing it now. Why am I better at tidying an imaginary video game apartment than my own fucking place? Oh, well. Boom. Boom. A boom. A boom. Oh, I guess it threw out the whole plate. <laughs> Why not? Clean the place up a bit. Uh huh. So far, so good. Do we have Do we have any more trash lying around? Yeah, quite a bit of trash actually. Well, since I'm in, since I'm in a responsible mode, I might as well do this. Slightly annoying that I can only take one piece of trash at a time, but that's fine. We shall deal with it. Hey, remember when this was about like a haunted computer or a game or whatever? <laughs> it seems like a while ago now. Alright, I don't see any more trash right now. Unless there's some in the bathroom. There is not. Alright, let's take the fucking laundry. So where exactly is the exit? Like... 416. Wait. He said 416. I'm in 326. Well, whatever. Let's see. Okay. That ain't it. Again. Absolutely riveting so far. Dumpty 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 dump. Dum 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 dee dum. Oh, that's the fire exit. Oh, really? Elevators out of order? Motherfucker. Alright, downstairs. This is very quickly turning into one of those days. So, laundry place. Where do I find the laundry place? I'm assuming over here. Where there's actually some kind of visible street. That's probably it, over there. Oh, wait, no. It's just road closed. Hmm. Plumbing and heating. Alright. Boy, you move so slow in this. Jeez. There it is. Laundry! Yay! Wash, dry, fold, repeat. Yeah, that's how that works. Hello, sir. I need to finish laundry first. Alright, fine. Pop it in. Okay. Hey, you there. You seem like a smart guy. I never trust each. These are these smartphones. I was the first one who invented those electronic cars. You mean electric cars? Yes, I assembled the first prototype, and then they stole my idea. Why didn't you patent it? Because it was in my dream, you dumb dummy. 
I forgot about it. Ten years later, boom! They're everywhere. That's no accident. I bet they grabbed it on my head while I was calling someone. I'm really sorry to hear that. Oh. I think my laundry just finished. But I want to talk to people. I just saw a receipt for 20 packs of noodles. Why did you boys order so much? I even left food in the fridge for you. You're doing what? A mukbang? Are you crazy? You're going to end up sick eating that much. I'm heading to the train station right now. When I get home, those noodles better still be in the kitchen. Or it's a year without your phone, understand? I never understood what a mukbang is, but I guess it's like just overeating for the sake of it. Just like making ridiculous amounts of food. My wife left me. I lost my job. And now this. My Miku-chan. Miku-chan? Yes, Miku-chan. My e-wife. They've made her available only with a subscription. How could they? Well, I think Miku-chan also needs to eat. That's it. Everyone wants something from me. Want something? Pay, pay, pay. Why can't simple things be available just like that? Well, money rules the world. I know. I know. I'll become a VTuber and my fans will donate to me. But you just said... That's different. They'll pay me because they love me, not because they have to. Well, you can think the same way about Miku-chan. This lion avatar. I've always had this lion aura around me. All right, well, good to hear you found your peace. Okay, I'm, I'm gonna get my, my laundry and get the fuck out. This is... I try not to judge, but this is getting weird even by my standards. Bye! Whoa! Was that the thing from the video game? Oh, there it is. Hmm. Well, so uh, oh, was that knocked over before? Can I please come into my apartment now? Or am I following the thing I just saw? I, go, I would like to go home, please. Okay, there's nothing I can do here, so why won't it let me in the house? I would like to go back to my apartment, if you please. It won't let me. So what do I need to do? Do I need to drop my laundry and... and Oh, there are people outside in the laundry, the laundromat. I guess you should talk to them. Oh, these are like gang members. Holy shit, look at these guys. Sorry, kiddo. Better go home and play video games. My goods are for level 18 players only. Merchant Guild policy. But if you're at a party with someone with higher level, I might discuss it with you. No, thank you. Oh, are we making fun of those uh, gangbanger game ads that are total bullshit? I think we are. Don't be mad at him. He's really a good guy. Candidate had a big year. Two award nominations. Hundreds of thousands of downloads. Still reviews. This office is where games are perfected pre-release. You will start with small prototypes to show us how quickly you improve them. Eventually, you might need major projects. What the... What the? He's repeating all the shit the CEO said. Sorry, man. Uh-oh. That guy got rejected by a girl at the bar last night. <laughs> Boss, please. And since then, he acts like a baby with everyone. Oh, start using dating apps and stop bothering people with his old school ways. Guys. Anyway, I hope we're square now. Everyone makes mistakes. What the fuck are you talking about? No, that's the whole smartphone conversation again. 
All right, can I? Oh, Jesus! Move! Are you blind? Can't you see I'm going inside? Dude, what the fuck? But I, w I was I already left. But Ow! Sorry, man. That guy going to check my girl. Wait. You know what she told him to start your dating at? Wait, hold on. Did the game like actually bug out, or is or is this on purpose to confuse the player? I am super lost. Everyone's got nuts with all this digital nonsense. What's wrong with that? Oh, back in my day, we only trusted things after years of everyone checking them out. Crap. Hold on, let me let me uh read him again. Millions download new apps the day they're out. Okay. Now one link can melt your computer, pop weird stuff on your screen. Wait, what? What? Melt the PC? Help with someone I know. Uh, no, the monitor thing. Right, some folks think that's funny. Imagine this. Your car's a smart your car's smart screen glitches and shows a car or a kid out of thin air. You panic, turn left, and boom. Somewhere far away, some troll is laughing hysterically. This is what chasing every new thing gets us. Uh, sounds like you're a bit of a pessimist. Maybe I am, and old, like she said. Maybe forget about her and try a dating app. Don't be mad at him. He's really a good guy. We all have weak spots that can turn us into beasts. So what are you guys doing here? The owner of this place is my old friend. Whoops. God damn it, I keep doing that. I came here to discuss some business matters with him. Guys are for laundry. What? Oh, oh, the guys are here for laundry. Okay, that whole scenario was fucking weird. I really genuinely cannot tell if it actually glitched or or if that was all just to mess with me. <laughs> well, I guess that's fitting for a game like this. All right, back I go. Right, finally, back to my apartment. 326, if I recall. Three twenty-four. Whoops, see Daisy. Oh, hold on. I need to see my task list. Uh return home, prepare to go to work. Right. Whoa! What? Someone left mail while I was doing the laundry? Okay. I'll just put this over here then. Oh, okay. Check the link. Visit the link? Uh, sounds sketchy. I guess it's okay to try on my PC before I leave for work. Where do I put the laundry, though? Alright, fuck it, you're going up. Okay. Whatever. Finish things before work. Right. I already cleaned up. Finish personal things before work. Oh, I think it meant, um... I think it meant the... the you know, cleaning up the trash. Alright, let's check the link. Um... I'm curious as to what's happening here. Yep. Mm-hmm. The legend is back. Hello there, everyone. Many of you have been curious about a certain individual recently, so it's time to share what I've discovered. You might know him from a startup that's made some great games over the last year. Let's call him Mystery Guy. Wait, is it about me? 
Here's a quick rundown based on the questions they've asked. You've asked. Sixteen years old. Wait, didn't they say he'd worked with the others for a while? Hobby graphic design prefers dogs or cats. Dogs. Family none. A few, but no details. Owns a fifth gen console, but doesn't play much. These details are quite creepy. Mystery guy recently left the startup and nailed an interview with a major company known for big projects. Expect some exciting stuff from him soon. And for the most curious ones, here's some detailed updates. Spotted entering the lobby of a fancy office building. Notice they have vending machines and a... What? Metrodonal? I don't know what that is. Wish my office had one. Saw his manager leaving the building. It was almost like a celebrity cortege. The street view around here is fantastic. Oh. Mr. Guy always carries pills with him. I found one in the trash, and I'm curious about it. Guess correctly, and I might send it to you for a closer look. Remember, share this channel with friends. And let me know who you want us to uncover next. Support my detective work by joining my official group. Cheers, and see you on the next investigation. Yeah, that's really fucking weird. I would need to take a closer look at this link later with someone more competent. That is scary, though. That's weird. I should head to work. Alright, off to work I go. Without locking my door. <laughs> After all that. All right, let's go to work. I have the night shift, so I guess I'm alone aside from the guard. Hey, buddy. Hello there. First day on the job, and also a night shift. Oh, youth. I'm Michael, but you can call me Mike. I handle security. Nice to meet you, sir. No need for formalities. It's stressful enough in the office, especially for the young folks. I understand, Mike. Need anything or just want to chat? Stop by for coffee. Thank you. Hmm. Alright, I guess we're just... Actually, I need some coffee right now. Okay, I guess I'll go get some coffee. Uh... Is this the coffee? Does this make coffee? Is there a coffee machine down here? Oh, how long have you been working here? Since I left the army, a bit older than you are now. The owner's wife was a good friend of mine. Uh, did you know this building used to be a hotel? Well, it has a cozy entrance. No wonder. How's it going? You see a lot of people coming all day? Ah, it comes with a job. I've come to enjoy it over the years. It's nice to meet so many different people. Ever seen anyone bad? What do you mean? Like, evil. <laughs> I believe everyone has good and bad sides. I've never met anyone purely evil. So I've noticed you're here during the day, too. Ah, sometimes I work extra hours. Besides, I don't have much else outside this building. Keeping 30 floors secure keeps me busy. It's routine, but rewarding. Okay. Interesting enough. I guess by I need a coffee, he just meant like, drink some coffee when you get to the top floor. Oh, well, not the top floor, but your office. Okay, up we go. And here we are. Stay out of the server room. That's gonna be interesting. This thing. I hate this thing. Surely something terrible is gonna happen with that. Oh. Hmm. The microwave is interactable. That's interesting. Right, anyway. Coffee time. Coffee time. Oh, they still have donuts out. Uh, those supposed to be getting stale. Alright. 
Slippy, slippy, slippy. <sighs> Alright, I'm gonna look around a little bit. He was talking about a key to his gun drawer. Hmm. All right, well, let's get to work, I guess. Not suspicious at all that my first day of work is a night shift alone. Especially considering I'm just some teenager. All right, let's see. Uh, combining ingredients should result in meals. Prepared food can be served to customers. Food can also be disposed in the trash. RPG Tavern. Oh. Oh, right. So... Well, mm-hmm. Uh, did I just hear something? No, you didn't. Everything's uh, everything's good. All right, so well, we got another bug. Okay. What's that sound? Yeah, I don't super love the noises I'm hearing. Oh. Wait, this is the bathroom. What happened in here? Rubik's Cube? Hmm. What, the server room? No. Nothing happened in here? No. Hmm. Nothing worth uh, noticing on the phone? Who's David, by the way? No. Nope. Okay. I'll just get back to work, I guess. Oh, a cup fell over. Huh. Curious. Well, back to work. Uh, all right. How do I make a cake? Yeah, yeah. What is what is it that person wants? Oh. How do I? I don't really understand how this... Oh, there we go. I'm not sure I really understand how this game works. But hey, clearly, like, it's not so much about the, uh... Not so much about the games to these people. Seems an awful lot like it's just about the monetization, which, you know, color me the fuck surprised, I guess. How do I, how did I make the one that had like a little bit of cream on it? I don't understand. I'm not seeing anything new in terms of bugs, so, right. Ah, there we go. Okay. Boom, 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 boom. Let's make the trash work. Okay, definitely not crazy about that noise. Seem like there's anything happening here. All right, back to work, I suppose. So, what's the last thing? Food can also be prepared for. 
Why does that say polishing? Oh, right. Adding the ads. Okay. Is there a problem with the electricity? I must be imagining this. Well, I finished work for today, and I can go home now. You sure about that? Because things seem kind of weird. And then home I go. I am homeward bound. So to speak. Oh, you're still here. Hi. Heading out already? Yep. Time flies, huh? Just got here and you're done. Well, they give me simple tasks. Ah, oh, the youth these days. Such a smart generation. You look a bit pale. Have you seen a ghost or something? <laughs> no, I'm, I'm just tired. My granddaughter's in college, busy like you. You should meet sometime. Oh, dear. Uh, maybe someday. If anything's off, you tell me, right? Well, I did hear these strange noises. Everyone's already left. I made sure of that. I'll check it out myself. Go home and don't worry. If there are ghosts, tonight just got more interesting. Bored of TV, anyway. Well, have a good night, Michael. He's gonna be dead when I arrive tomorrow, isn't he? Like, the game just did so much work to make him likable. And I just sent him upstairs to see the ghosts. He's gonna be dead in the morning. Yep, I'm ready to leave the office. Get me out of here. Wakey, wakey, X and baggy. Oh. What? Uh. Oh, my mouse sensitivity was super low because the, I just woke up. Okay, that's kind of cool, actually. I like that. Whoop. Oh, I finally got a message from David. All right, David, who the fuck are you? Let me see. Hey, how was the interview? Did they offer you a private driver? Want to meet at our usual spot? Hey there. The interview went well, but something happened. I'm not sure how to tell you. I think I had those incidents again. Okay. Let's meet in a few hours. I need to finish some things, and I'll be there. Great. I'll make something to eat while I wait. Dude, you work at a big place now. Can't you buy a nice burger? Stop saving for a moment. You're not an indie anymore. I'm just really hungry. Alright, see you soon. I mean, you don't have to always eat burgers. <laughs> like, I should have some food in the fridge. Asian noodles, pizza slices, or gyoza dumplings. Ooh, gyoza dumplings sound good. Do these choices matter, like, at all? <laughs> All right. Oh, pills. I should. Can I take the pills? Apparently not. All right. I'll just eat. I dreamed of being a chef as a kid, loving to cook for mom. But cooking with love all day, every day? Hmm. Maybe not. This could use more salt. Well, time to meet my friend. I guess they meant at the usual spot, wherever that is. So, okay, out I go. Okay, I think sound cut off for a second. That was weird. Sorry about that. Is that my friend? He looks like 12. Oh, hello. <laughs> Hi. Nice place, though. Cafe Missima. So, how are you, man? I think it was a mistake. I shouldn't have left the studio. Or my friends. Hey, stop that. It's nobody's fault. Life happens. Everyone's actually happy for you. You've got to stop blaming yourself all the time. Just keep moving forward. 
We'll all back you up. Now, what happened in the interview? That does sound creepy. Anything else? Yep, tell him about the website. Let's see. The link was in the letter. Hmm. Here's a dead link. Just says link doesn't exist. Guess I should have mentioned the letter first, but... There's a blank paper in there. What? Here, take a look yourself. On the envelope it says, you're the sender. Receiver and sender are the same person. I think I'm going crazy. I believe that must be a rational explanation. Oh, that's the game I was working on before. Something doesn't seem right here. Wait, do you also see that? Car game simulator? That's the one I was working on there. Don't they all look kind of similar? No. No, this is the one. It couldn't leave office. I was working on it a day ago. It's a prototype with no content. I see. Let me take a picture. Betrayer? Listen, all this might seem crazy, but something's not right. I've known you long enough to see when things are off. Then what is it? Look, let me double check everything and I'll get back to you. For now, you don't deserve his help, Jesus. For now, don't beat yourself up about leaving the studio. We'll sort out the rest later. If anything else weird happens, call me right away. Thank you, David. You're off to work now, right? Yeah. Let's head out then. I'll handle things from home. Okay. Okay, I don't know why sound is cutting out. That's a little weird. Sorry about that. Anyway. Unless he has more to say. No. Well, then let's just leave. No, Michael is still there. So, so far, so good. He ain't dead yet. But I feel like he will be very soon. Back again, early bird. Looking better today. Hello, Michael. Checked everywhere last night. No intruders. Oh, I probably just imagined it. I'll keep it a closer eyes today. No distractions. Thanks. It's probably just stress. Tell me if you hear anything. Thanks, Michael. Take care. Okay. Nothing extra to say about to him. Let's just go fix bugs, then. These shitty-ass mobile games they're making. Feels like I need some energy today. Today, I'm not skipping the cup. I think the coffee might be fucking with me. The game is very insistent on the coffee, so I think there might be something in the drink. But I'm gonna keep going. I'm gonna keep actually doing the coffee. Let's let's pretend I didn't just have that thought. Every time I drink it, this happens. Hmm. This is certainly curious. Alright, let's see. Uh, whoop. Run, pirate, run. Oh, no, no, go back. Restartable with R. Oh. Jumps on W. Well, retry didn't work, so... Input lags noticed after 100 score. Running speed grows with progress. Oh, I heard that. Definitely heard that. A door opened. Hmm. Still can't go in there. Everything's fine in here. Alright. 
I will admit, the game is getting creepier. I really like the part of the cafe where you're like seeing things on the screen. That was good. All right, let's keep working. Mm hmm. Nope. Okay. So how about collision? How does collision go? That works. Okay. Got to jump up. Fuck! Wow, he jumps slow as ass. Okay, jump. Okay, jump. Input lags noticed. Yep, there we go. Was that a microwave sound? Whoops, no, let's go. Uh, pretty sure that was a microwave sound, yeah. Just a little sip of courage. Keep expecting this guy to do something. Oh. Those are my gyoza dumplings from earlier. Oh, hi. Oh my god. Yeah, that was mildly strange. The fuck? Okay, buddy. I'm, uh... Locked. Nothing left but to break it. Why would this be locked? Okay. That's gonna be hard to explain to your boss in the morning. Oh, look at that. Floating coffee. Hmm. I wonder if you can actually just play the game without drinking the coffee ever and just have nothing happen. <laughs> All right, let's see. Uh, okay. Jump. 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 Boy, this fucking sucks. Jump. 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 What is that? Game something? Game speed. Okay. Oh, here we go. Get behind me. Fucking stop doing that. I'm just imagining this. It doesn't seem like there's anything happening. No, god damn it, I keep <sighs> I keep accidentally, you know. Let me let me work. Okay. I guess in a moment it'll want me to uh whoops. To make ads for it. Which God knows I don't want to do. Because that is some shit right there. Yep. There goes the power again. I'm starting to not love this job. Like, something with the electricity. I should check the switches in the server room. Pretty sure you were told to stay the fuck out of the server room, but... I mean, I get it. It's locked. Keys could be kept in the security stand. I feel like this screen is going to so show something terrible at some point. Man, are you there? It's urgent. Low signal. What the? 
It's urgent, it's urgent, it's urgent. Yeah, I'm like trying to... I'm trying! Okay, get me... Get me downstairs. Okay, what sort? Won't let me do anything now. Hello? I can't exit the phone. Oh, here we go. Yes, David, what is it? I looked at that letter again. It has some kind of shiny coating. Something that shows up under light. Double check the website. Someone wiped it clean. They've covered tracks, but I caught it. Why did you learn to check on these things? Did you know our manager was a hacker before he started making games? He was in charge of security in games. Well, we didn't talk much about it. Weird, since you were his favorite, like his protege. Just get to the point. Alright, he taught me a lot. And that game on the cafe? It came from your company's secure server. Someone's really messing with you. Are you some kind of CIA agent or something? <laughs> no, just very good analytic, you know. I'm stressed, man. Life just went out of my floor. Everything's happened again. Told you, call me anytime. Thanks, I'll talk to security and let you know what's up. I just went down to the lobby. Keep me updated, will do. Okay. Well... Michael. Well, I was right about him dying. So that fucking sucks. Alright, I'm gonna have to go to the security desk and see if I can find the key. I should call David immediately. Yeah, you probably should. Can I just call him, call him? Michael is dead. What? Wait, who's Michael? Security guy. Someone killed him. He's right here in front of me. Get the hell out of there! Now! I'm calling the cops. This is no longer our concern. Leave. Now. Ready to leave office? He won't even put the phone down. I'm not running. I'm going to stop this guy myself. What? Are you crazy? He killed a security officer. You can't go there and handle a criminal. My first day, my team lead mentioned he keeps a gun in his, car in his cardboard? <laughs> I'm going to find it. You're insane. I'm on my way and police will be there soon. Please just stay alive. I'll try. Was I supposed to, like, react quicker and just leave? Okay, fuck this coffee. Uh, right. Let's go find the- let's go find the gun. Oh. Gotta wonder how many, uh... Do you have the key? Oh, I got a screwdriver and the security keys. Okay. I'm just waiting for this to do something. See to crouch. Why can I crouch now? Oh, hold on. I need the gun. Before I do anything else. Oh, Jesus! Hi! Well. <laughs> Guess that's me. Strange noise at work. Caught. Well, catched, but... After the discovery of the body, the police searched the entire building but found no one inside. Everything pointed to murder and abduction, but with no leads or witnesses, the case remained in the archives. The indie studio you used to work for was the most shaken by this news. After a year, the studio found a strange employee who only worked remotely. But he was almost as good as you. The studio got back on his feet. David refused to accept your disappearance and spent many years searching for you. What the hell? 
Alright, I still don't understand what the fuck is going on, but... Alright. So what's going on in here in the server room? I can't see shit. Try to be careful here. Okay, lights are back on. So now whoever is fucking with me can't exactly hide. At, at least. Must find a place to hide. Here? Can I hide here? Um, oh, oh! Closet. Somehow, even though there were shelves in it. There you are. You spooky looking fuck. Yeah, yeah. Oh shit. Yeah, no. Come on. Yeah, got him. Get fucked, you dick. Let's go for the gun. Yes. Come on, come on. Yes, gun acquired. I hope it's not loaded with blanks. Oh, here he comes. Got him! B manager? You remind me of myself at your age. Smart, but foolish. These corporations, they only care about ratings and money. They don't care about the soul, or passion in their work, just profits. Staying with them would have destroyed you, just like it almost did to me. You killed Michael. That was a mistake. I didn't mean for him to find me. That's your excuse? I was trying to save you from making my mistakes. A bright young guy thinking he's hit the jackpot with his job. But you'd end up just as lost and damaged as the rest of us. Enough. I don't want to hear this. I only wanted the best for you. To chase your dreams. Hopefully, one day you'll understand. Enough! Don't move! I wonder how many more choices I have. Like, could I shoot him? Like, kill him? Well, a few weeks later. So, uh, yeah. So it's the manager, huh? They put him away for good. It's a real shame. You were his favorite. Who knew he'd lose it when you joined a big company? Don't blame yourself. It was all him, not you. I'm not blaming myself. You've come a long way from all this. So what's the plan now? I heard they really wanted you to stay on. You really quitting? Yeah, I'm starting my own thing. I want to be the captain of my own ship. In search of yourself, huh? Ready to go? Anything else on your mind? Remember when we first met him? At the orphanage? Can't forget that day. Why do you ask? It's nothing. Never mind. But what are you going to do now? Well, back to the studio. The guys want me to run things. Lazy sheep. You sure you don't want to come back? Guys would be really happy. Nah, you're the best for it. Oh, come on. You're always flattering me so you can focus on more interesting things. Well, maybe just a little. Maybe you want to ask me something? <laughs> Got a ton of things to ask, but that can wait. Actually, there is something. Why'd the company drop the lawsuit against him all of a sudden? Well, maybe to avoid more publicity. Kind of odd, right? They were pushing hard at first. I don't think you should worry about it. Yeah, probably. In any case, the main thing is that you're safe. Yeah, maybe. What about the guard, Michael? Well, his family got a decent settlement. His granddaughter's tuition is covered. Did you meet them? No. Why not? I don't think it's a good idea. 
Are you blaming yourself for everything that happens on the pla on the planet again? I only knew him for a few days. You now I think you should look at yourself in a slightly brighter light. Sometimes. Maybe you could do that on Thursdays, or say, every Friday. How about every odd Monday? Oh, you're hopeless. Ready to go? Anything else in your mind? Nah, we can go. Alright, let's go. I'm sorry. Take care of yourself. Huh. Well. Are we doing credits now? Why is there a counter for the credits? Are the credits really five minutes long? Well, that was certainly interesting. Uh, I didn't expect it to go into like... Because it, it seems so clearly supernatural at first. So I didn't expect it to go into, like, Scream-esque modern slasher pet territory. But I guess it makes a certain amount of sense, like, nothing that ha- Aside from, I don't know how he would have snuck up on me with that mannequin and put a mask on it. But I guess he really was just trying to scare me into leaving at first, like... He wasn't actually trying to hurt me or kill me. But mostly to just drive me nuts, so I wouldn't want to work at that company, and then, you know, get me back for his company. <laughs> or you could have, you know, had a conversation with the kid and been like, Hey, listen, I know this seems like a good opportunity, but shit is gonna, not going to work out the way you think it is. <laughs> or maybe he did try that and the kid wasn't listening. Who knows? Um, yeah, it's a little slow. I will say. Um, I get that you're going for a sort of Fears to Fathom Chilas art vibe here, but it takes a little too long to do totally meaningless things. Like, the whole laundry segment was kind of weird, didn't really amount to anything. And I'm still not sure what the hell happened with those thugs. Like, that was really, really fucking weird. But aside from that, neat little game. I, I am curious what kind of endings I've missed. And, um... I hope I can try those out in just a second, once we're past these credits here. I wonder if I can skip them. Oh, okay, I can. Uh, right. Give me a moment, and I will see if I can uh, try some other endings. Yes, let's try to just leave the office. Strange noises at work ran away. After the discovery of the body, the police searched all the building, but couldn't find any person inside. An anonymous call claimed a tall individual in a hood was seen entering the building with a knife. With insufficient evidence to pursue this lead, the police concluded that you were the perpetrator. The court sentenced you to compulsory treatment in a psychiatric clinic. Whether it was someone's malicious intent, or you are indeed ill haunted. Oh, or if you are indeed ill, haunted you for the remaining years. Okay, so that didn't work out for anybody. Like, the manager doesn't get what he wanted out of it either. Because now I'm in jail. <laughs> well, not in jail, in a psychiatric clinic. Alright, I want to see if I can kill him. Once we, uh, once I get to the final showdown there. You know, something occurred to me. I, I said earlier how, um... How it didn't seem like he wanted to hurt me. But at the same time, like... <laughs> he did bring a knife. According to the other endings, and the fact that he killed Michael. So why would he do that if he didn't want to hurt me? Yeah, I don't really get his motivations, but uh, let's just shoot. There he is. Fuck you, fuck you, fuck you, fuck you! <laughs> mm-hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Talk, talk, talk. Oh, I can't shoot him. I can't kill him. So we just get the same ending. Alright, hold on, let me get back to the main menu. Alright, so if there's anything more I can do in this, uh, any more, um... What is this place that we're seeing here, by the way? If there's anything more I can do, anything else, any other endings, I don't know. This was a solid effort. Like I said, I find it a little slow. 
Um, I like the manager's motivation, but I think it's a little bit confused because, you know, why did he bring a fucking knife if he didn't want to hurt me? So there's a couple things that could be touched up, but aside from that, decent little free game. Creepy, creepy Ways FM. Nice work. See you in another one, folks, and bye-bye. Yeah.